Welcome to First This, a short mindfulness practice and message for any time. I'm Catherine Nikolai. Thanks for being here. Let's settle in. Any posture is good. You can lay on your back with your legs up a wall. You can sit or stretch out flat. You know, even if something seems to work for everyone else but doesn't work for you, it doesn't mean that there's something wrong with you and that you have to keep doing it. It's okay to try something different. And you never have to explain yourself. Let's take a deep breath in. Out through the mouth. One more time. Breathe in. Release it. Good. Just natural breath now. Lips together, breathing through your nose. Calmly pointing your attention at your breath. When you inhale, You're aware of it. When you breathe out, you notice. And when you realize you're not doing that anymore, just start over. It doesn't matter why. Still there, in and out. I often find that if I know why something is beneficial to me, it's a whole lot easier for me to make it a habit. And today I was thinking about why we work on being present. And I'm going to skip over the brain health bit and the other physiological reasons. They're extensive, but... 
Let's look at why being present helps us feel calmer and happier. You deserve to feel calm and happy. The simplest reason why present is good is that when we're present, we slow down. We get a chance to notice more about the moment. And lots and lots of each moment is good, feels good, sights, Sounds, textures that are pleasant and soothing. When we slow down, we get to feel them and just be reminded that they exist. Just feel your breath coming and going. So that's it, really. We are often in pursuit of something. And that singular focus to get to a particular end to do something, it stops us noticing all the little goods of each moment. So maybe just a little homework. A few times today. Try slowing down. And noticing the small details of the moment. You don't have to declare everything is wonderful. We're not playing pretend. We are just filling in the actual details of your sensory experience. Being present doesn't mean you're putting on rose-colored glasses. You're actually just taking off the gray ones and seeing things as they are. Let's be present together for one more minute.
Well done. Let's take a deep breath in and out. And then one more time, breathe in. Let it go. Good.